Good afternoon again, everybody. Uh, today we are out here at LKN Blends and Bowls with Nicole. And Nicole has got some really, really crazy positive things going on here. Uh, I know we're heading to Ultimate Ales after this, but we could not miss the opportunity to come down here and speak with Nicole a little bit because she has gone outside the box and is really, really supporting the local community. Here we were trying to support them, and she's taking it a whole step further uh, into actually making sure that those that are really, really uh, affected by this actually have an outlet. And with that, I'd like to, to introduce Nicole. And I'd just real quick, give us an overview of what the effort is you have going on here right now. Um, so basically what we're doing and what we're looking for is we are trying to get back to the community, to the people that, the servers, the people that are elderly that can't get out of their homes, um, any families that are in need, We've been taking donations from anybody that's willing to give monetary donations. Um, and then basically, I am buying food from my vendor, which is at a wholesale price, a cost price, and then we're donating it out to the family. So it's allowing us to get a lot more um, stuff for our money. And it's been absolutely amazing the amount of people that we've helped so far. Um, I was basically, I've had two or three people already send me messages back showing me that they've been able to feed their family now. So it's been very, very impactful and the people that we have helped so far are beyond grateful. Okay, so as you can tell, you know, we, we came out here originally and we wanted to highlight them uh, to support them. They're doing, you're, you're still having your takeout business as far as normal hours. What kind yeah. of hours are you running on the takeout business? So we're still open for business, our normal hours, which is, you know, our Monday through Friday, which is 7 a.m. to 5 p.m. And then Sundays were 8 to 4, and Saturdays were 10 to 3. So today we're here from 10 to 3. Um, doing takeout, we also will do delivery. So if you guys want to, you know, text or call, go on our website or Facebook page, we will definitely do deliveries to your house. Okay. Uh, are those normal hours? Are those the, the typical store hours? Or are yes. those just while we're, we're, we're in this? And as you can see, you know, we're trying to keep our separation. So I'm not intentionally trying to yell at Nicole, but we're trying to make sure we have our safe distance in between. We want to be sure we're practicing what we're preaching and doing our part in getting everybody past this and hopefully getting the economy back up and rolling again. So trying to maintain the distance here, but I'm not, uh, not trying to yell at Nicole, but I want her to talk a little bit more because there have been a lot of people, we were just talking about this about five minutes ago, that have come in and have given donations to you. Uh, yes. Small monetary donations, some larger, uh, and just basically saying, hey, go help the community, use your channels. Go yes. ahead, expand a little on that. Yeah, so I guess I'm in a very fortunate situation because of the fact that um, I am a restaurant business, so I am allowed to keep my doors open um, from this standpoint, definitely for carryout, definitely for delivery, um, and I will continue to deliver no matter what. And basically, I also am able to get a ton of food. Like our vendors right here in Statesville, um, Cheney's, they basically said to me, you know, I put your orders in, we'll make sure we get you the food that you need. So I, yes, I am a health food store and I do smoothies and I do clean eating food, but we are bringing in chicken, we're bringing in steak, we're bringing in hamburger, we're bringing in whatever the community needs right now. Um, eggs, so anything, any little donation, if it's a $5 donation, a $1 donation, any little bit will help feed a family for at least a week. And they're planning on this probably to maybe go on for two to four weeks. And you have a lot of people out there that are out of work right now. All your servers, all of your restaurant workers, your retail workers. And these are the people that I'm trying to really hone in on and make sure that they can feed their families for the next four weeks. Nicole, tell us, just uh, we're down here only because I want everybody to know where you are, how they can get in touch with you. Uh, are you doing anything online? Is it strictly by phone? Is it strictly by drop-in? Uh, the address here, where yep. whereabouts you're located? So we are in the Public Shopping Center on Brawley School Road. So we are, our address is 647 Brawley School Road, Mooresville, North Carolina. Um, and you can, on my Facebook page is my actual home phone number. Um, and it's actually right here, my cell phone number. So we yeah, didn't plan it this way. But everybody's it didn't work out this getting way. my cell phone number, which has been working out great because I've been able to keep track of everybody's requests for food. Um, so if you are looking for food, if you want to give a donation, if you want to place an order and just have us deliver an order to your house, um, you can go, that is probably the best way to get a hold of me. Um, and in the end, if I still have four amazing employees that um, are staying with me and going through this with me, they have not quarantined themselves yet. Um, and as far as how are we keeping ourselves healthy, healthy um, 
We use a lot of essential oils here. We use On Guard for cleaning. We, there was a study that was shown that lime juice, lemon juice, apple cider vinegar, all these things can help with this virus and get into it and get through it. So we've been doing a lot of shots of that. Um, and all those are things that we also carry here, elderberry syrup that you guys can get from us. So if you guys are wanting or needing to have ideas or know ways to help with the virus, um, text me and I can actually help walk you through that also. Awesome, awesome. Uh, again, this is kind of that one-off, all right? We're, we're out here trying to support local businesses, trying to make sure that, that these guys can weather the storm, uh, keep their employees employed, keep the ball rolling, all right? We'll all get through this with the community's help, but this is truly a, a step above, and I'd like to thank Nicole for putting this all together. Uh, we, were, we became aware of this less than 24 hours ago. It's an amazing opportunity for those of you that have the means to come down and help out. Uh, she is here, she will take donations as far as that goes. Please come and support them, not only in this endeavor, but once we get past this, uh, make sure you're coming out, make sure you're checking out the takeout, make sure you come down here, and even if you just come and say hi and tell Nicole how much it's appreciated that she's helping out the community here, uh, we greatly appreciate it. On behalf of Support Local, LKN, uh, we really appreciate you guys being here, and please, by all means, hit us up on the Facebook page, and if you need any contact information for Nicole, we'd be glad to pass that on to you as well. Thank you all, stay healthy. Thank you.